Cambry. I'm at my cabin, so pardon my casual attire, although I did put on some lip gloss because you are special. So special, in fact, that I'm going to show you how easy it is to make that fresh brown sugar body scrub knockoff that I'm always talking about. I know I've put the instructions on Facebook and, and as a recipe on my blog and everything, but sometimes you just need to see it to believe it just how easy this stuff is to make. And I'm not joking, it is as good, if not better, than what Fresh charges like 65 bucks for a tiny little jar. It's crazy. All right, let's get started. Here I am in my kitchen and I'm ready to make this Fresh Brown Sugar Body Scrub Knockoff. And this is all that you need to make it. Seriously, this is it. You need brown sugar, coconut oil, olive oil, sugar in the raw or turbinado sugar and lemongrass essential oil or any other citrusy essential oils that might appeal to you. Um, this all can be found in a grocery store except for maybe the lemongrass. But listen, I found this in this little teeny rinky dink town here in the Catskills. So I know that you're going to be able to find it wherever you are. Um, try a health food store for one, and if all else fails, Amazon, because you know, they have everything and they're taking over the world. Scary. Okay, anyway, let's get started. So what you want is a half a cup of brown sugar, a half cup of sugar in the raw, And a quarter cup of coconut oil. A quarter cup of olive oil. And I'm going to drop in about 10 drops to 20 drops of lemongrass. And a lot more comes out when you drop it like that, like three or four droplets come out at a time. So it probably ends up being about 20 drops. You mix it all together and that's it. That's it. Seriously, that's it. It's ready. Go take a bath. Scrub away all the hate and the dead skin. And well, maybe you can't scrub off the hate, but you can try because it smells so good and it feels so good and it leaves your skin feeling just so moist and moisturized and ca caressed, kissed by me or brown sugar or something. Um, here, I'll show you how I package it. Put it in a plastic jar if you can because it is in the bathtub and it is very slippery. Plastic is better. I got these plus these cute little labels from myownlabels.com. So if you wanna make them as gifts, you can get these customized labels or you can just put them in the leftover Tupperware, which is half the time what I do. And I wanna show you what it looks like after it's settled because this has already been used in the bathtub and you can see all the oil is up at the top. So right before I use it, I just take my finger in and I squish it around and then I take out a little scoop, about a tablespoon for my knees, my elbows, my décolletage, you know how it is. And that's it. Be careful when you get out of the tub because it might leave the tub slippery. And pat yourself dry rather than rub yourself dry so that you can retain all that moisture. I hope you love it. I do. Thanks.